Hi, this is Steve Nicolarat from Coach Baseball Ride. Today I want to talk to you a little bit about catching. And in particular, I'd like to talk with you about what I look for when I'm trying to identify a potential catcher. So the first thing that, that's important to, um, to look for in a kid is leadership. I'm looking for a leader. I'm looking for somebody that can take charge out there. I'm looking for somebody that when things aren't going so good, he can kind of pick us up. I'm looking for somebody that that's not going to be hesitant to step in front of the plate and move the outfielders around or just manage the game. I need a leader. I need a guy that can handle his pitchers and go out there and talk with them and make sure that that he encourages his pitchers and he's and he's working with these kids in a very optimistic type of way. Um, in the old days, I remember um, my dad used to coach a team, and, and sometimes they would they would put big guys, you know, like like at catchers. And to be honest with you, I look for athletes, um, and they don't have to be real big for me to be a catcher. But athletic is a really really good thing. Um, what do I mean by athletic? I like a kid who has quick movements, a kid that um, has quick feet, a kid that has a quick release on the ball. Um, so an athletic kind of catcher. I like a catcher that can actually go out and make an off-balance play when he feels a bunt and makes a throw to first base or a throw to third base. He can actually field his position. He's got some energy back there. He's athletic. Um, and, of course, I, I like a kid that can throw, a guy that has a nice arm. But I, I guess I also really want a kid that can have a, a good, quick release. Good arm but a quick release, and a guy that's willing to work for those things. He's not content to just be happy with who he is. He wants to get better. Um, I want a guy that can see the game. What I mean by see the game, again, it's moving your infield, moving your outfield according to who's hitting or who's pitching. Um, it's a guy that can call pitches. He's aware of what this hitter weaknesses may be by his stance or, or maybe uh, by some previous experiences with this hitter. He knows where this pitcher's at right now, and he knows what's a good pitch to throw. So he's a guy that I can let call the game. So when you're working with identifying certain kids that might be catchers, I hope you keep some of these things in mind. Uh, and as always, uh, make sure you go to coachbaseballright.com to check out some of our other outstanding products.